Docker is somewhat like a virtual machine, but it's not exactly the same. Unlike traditional virtual machines, Docker is faster and much more lightweight. If you need to run a specific program that requires a particular environment, Docker is an excellent solution. Docker works by using containers that run on top of your existing operating system through the Docker software. Instead of installing a full operating system like a virtual machine, Docker only takes the necessary components required to run your desired application, making it a more efficient and streamlined option. Installing Docker is quick and easy. Just follow these simple steps. First, visit docker.com. Download Docker Desktop for Mac. Make sure you choose the correct version based on your hardware, let's say Intel or Apple Silicon. After finishing the download process, double-click the downloaded DMG file. Drag and drop Docker into the Applications folder. Then, open Docker from Launchpad. Accept the license agreement, click Finish, enter your password, and skip the unnecessary steps. You can create an account and log in if you want a better experience. That's it, you're ready to start using Docker. Once Docker is installed and set up, installing OpenFoam is simple. First, go to your search engine and find Install OpenFoam Docker for Mac and you will be directed to this page. Then, download the OpenFoam Docker script by first right-clicking the OpenFoam Docker script link to open it in a new tab. Then, save the script to a convenient location in your directory, in this example, on my document folder. Next, open a terminal to execute the next steps. Find your downloaded OpenFoam Docker file in your directory CD here is to change the directory. In the directory, you can execute mv to rename the openfoamdocker.txt to openfoamdocker. This is not a mandatory step, but it will make your future steps easier. The next step is to make the script executable and create links to preferred OpenFoam versions and image flavor by executing these commands. Make sure you are inside the directory where you store the OpenFoam, OpenFoam file docker file to execute this. Then we make a kind of shortcut to our specific versions of OpenFoam by running this script. You can check the latest version of OpenFoam before running this. Finally, launch OpenFoam by simply running this script. Make sure Docker is active before executing this command. Especially when you are restarting your machine. You can check the installation by running a simple OpenFoam command, for example, this block mesh help. If the installation succeeds, you can see the help from OpenFoam about block mesh on your terminal. Paraview, the post-processing software used to visualize OpenFoam simulation data is not included in the Docker installation version. 
you will need to download and install it manually by first visiting paraview.org. Then download and install your preferred version. Once installed, Paraview will allow you to analyze and display your simulation results effectively.